Hey there, just wanted to touch base. It's been quite a while since I did an update. Uh, let's see. Uh, after that update, I had a, had a local tournament. This is back in December now. Um, shot to... Things are going decent there. I was shooting a blue bow at the time, and my small arrows, the CXL Pros, inner 10, shot great, shot a 596. And then uh, went over to the Berlin Indoor Open. And over there, shot really well qualification, shot good. Shot a pair of 297s in her, so a 594. Uh, was uh, second place, tied for second and third qualification with another 94. Went through the eliminations and the matches and shot really well. Ended up getting a bronze medal map uh, over there. Despite having some uh, a little bit of equipment issue, some string technical difficulties, uh, got bumped by somebody on the line and it popped a few strands of my main string during a match. No problem, shot four arrows like that. Three tens to tie and then a close to center ten to win the shoot off and just on the fly you gotta do what you gotta do so just whipped a little piece of serving on there and you probably saw the photos on Facebook and Instagram and stuff and, and just got through the rest of the tournament and did well. Didn't hurt anything but it was a little unexpected. Total freak thing that can happen with these tournaments. Came home and uh, getting ready for the Christmas and holiday season. I missed a bunch of time practicing, training. I was down for about 18 days with some stuff I had going on. Then it was New Year's before I really got to shoot again and started shooting only just a handful of days before I had to jet off to Iowa Pro-Am in Des Moines, Iowa. Went over there and just because of the downtime, some things I had going on, I didn't really my practice time wasn't what I wanted it was practice time it wasn't training it I really practiced without consequences and without determination that really hurt my performance in Iowa so you know kind of what I believe in is if you practice without consequences you're gonna go and compete without focus and that's what happened and the entire day during Saturday on the blue and white I just wasn't focused, I wasn't really in the moment. Sure, I was shooting good, but just maybe running on autopilot too much. And I ended up dropping one on the blue and white. Shot a 359 X's, so. Second day come around and it was more of the same, slow start. You know, shot 11-11-10, then 11-11-10. Cleaned out to the last end and really just wanted to seal the deal, but still struggled with focus and determination and, and just, just wasn't in the moment. And on the last end I shot I shot 10, 11, 11 to finish. So there, overall, I ended up eight. Then after that, it was off to the ATA trade show for four days of that. And I just got back home the other day. So with roughly a week until Lancaster, it's uh, full on. It's gloves off time. It's you know it, practicing and training with focus, with determination so that I can go and compete without distractions. Now in the meantime, equipment wise, uh, built a couple of different bows. I've been back playing with arrows again. Initially right now it looks like Lancaster. I'm gonna be rolling back on my CXL Pros and I'm actually gonna be shooting a, a bronze uh, colored Prime 1 that I built. And the only reason being is it, it just seemed to just sit a little better. You know what it is, I can't put my finger on, but there's no, you know, by the numbers there's no draw length, no poundage, no hold and weight, no stabilization, no tune changes from one bow to the next, just what you get sometimes. One bow just sits a little better than the other. So that's what I've got going on right now. Yesterday was my first day shooting in uh, since the Sunday in Iowa. So uh, yesterday was Saturday. That was, it was like six days and shot at the house. I shot, uh, shot just one round, 30 arrows and shot 29X. So that was really solid. And then I uh, met some of my buddies over at the range, which is where I'm headed now, and shot two rounds there with those guys just walking in cold. Uh, no practice, no warm-ups, no ciders, pin up a new face and go. And that's what this whole week is going to be about. It's just going to be about pinning up a new face, no practice, no BS, and just go. And, uh, and I shot 28-28. So I was really pleased with that. So, you know, yesterday I shot 90 arrows, and I was down five Super X's or five 11s for Lancaster with my small arrows, my 9.3 mil uh, CXL Pro 350. So that's what I'm gonna roll with equipment wise, but attitude wise, there needs to be a total change. There needs to be a commitment to focus and determination. Kind of getting back to some of the stuff I talked about in the first few videos. And you know, that's just kind of what, I, what I'm gonna to try to target this week. So I can go to Lancaster and I can go there and I can shoot with determination and focus, which is where I need to be. So think about that. 
when you guys go into competition. If you're feeling unfocused or unconnected, you probably can look back at your practice and see where you could have utilized that time better. So that's what I'm going to do. And I'd, I'd urge you guys to take a look at the same thing. So we'll uh, drop you a video here and give you a shout in the next day or so how this goes. And uh, I'll talk to you then. Bye.